Hey guys, it's Lyle. Uh, I'm really excited to have my brand new auto floor guard. I'm really pumped. I got the mid-size edition and I hope you guys are ready here to help me unbox it. Let's get this thing open and find out what's inside. Let's check out this product. Let's get this box opened up. I can't wait to see how easy it is to set it up. Uh, pretty pumped uh, by the looks of this thing. It looks like it is going to catch all my mess in my garage, exactly what I've been looking for. Um, yeah, this thing looks tough. Let's open it up and let's, uh, let's find out what all kinds of goodies are in here. So we got some informational materials to help us get it set up. Alright, we got some pieces that we put in the corners, um, which help it stay put. So when you drive on and off of it, it doesn't get messed up. And then uh, a new feature here that I think is pretty awesome. I'm uh, pretty excited to get this out of here. They've actually included a squeegee with the kit right now. Um, this squeegee is going to allow me to easily mop up any of the mess that drains off of my car. Let's pull out here the thing you've all been waiting to see. Uh, yeah, this thing, it's a beast. 28 pounds in a box. Let's check it out. Alright, here it is folks. It's a, the auto floor guard. Wow, this thing is, uh, yeah, beefy. Um, can't wait to unroll this, and uh, let's see how it does in the garage. So as you can tell, I'm here in my garage, and I've had a lot of problems with just mess and slop getting in here on the garage floor. Uh, it was raining today, and my wife um, drove in, and we still have some of the slop sitting here. And if you're like me, I got a lot of things sitting around in my garage. I have some drywall that I'm using for a project my tools, just stuff that I want to keep dry. You know, I hate messing with that mess. And uh, I'm really excited because I think this uh, new um, auto floor guard containment system is really going to keep my floor dry and keep the mess uh, in a place where I can easily get rid of it and keep my garage floor nice and clean. So I'm excited to test this out. All right, here we are. We're going to unroll the auto floor guard. Uh, yeah, this is sweet. All right, we're going to open up the auto floor guard and uh, just see how much area it's going to protect here in my garage. Uh, we're going to see how easy this thing is to set up. All right, I've got my brand new auto floor guard set up in my garage. Um, it's actually been a pretty snowy, uh, really just a messy day today. This is the perfect day to debut it. I can't wait to test it out. It's been snowing, and then that changed to sleet, and it's been freezing raining, and uh, I'm ready to pull my car in here and uh, see how this thing handles the, handles the mess. Um, so as you can tell, uh, this car is covered in snow and salt and just slush and everything from a day's driving out in this uh, first storm of the year. And uh, I can actually hear the water just dripping off of the car and being caught on the mat. And uh, yeah, it just sounds really great. And uh, I know that that mat is catching everything, keeping it contained. And uh, it's keeping my garage floor clean. It's keeping my garage floor dry and it's keeping the things that I care about in this garage um, clean and dry as well. Hey, thanks for watching. Um, you just watched me unbox my brand new auto floor guard. I have the midsize edition here, and as you can tell, it fully covers the needs of my Passat wagon here, which is a very long car. And so this floor mat, uh, it's gonna contain everything that you need, 18 feet long here with the midsize, midsize edition. And uh, yeah, I'm nothing but impressed um, so far. Uh, you can tell that's keeping the snow off my car or off my garage floor. And uh, yeah, I'm really pumped. Again, uh, make sure you get your auto floor guard um, today. Uh, I know it's going to keep my garage clean this winter. And I know it can keep your garage clean too. So initial impressions, I'm giving it a great, um, really high quality material. I can really tell it's staying where it needs to. And uh, it's doing a great job keeping my garage floor clean already. 
So as you guys can tell, I've had my auto floor guard set up for about a month now and it's really collected a lot of debris and water and just slop from uh, road salt and snow and just regular rain and other road debris. Um, I'm just keeping my garage floor clean. Uh, the mat's acquiring a little bit of layer of stuff on it, but that's okay, that's what it's for. Um, so I let it sit out here for about a month and I've let kind of the natural um, unrolling happen. It's pretty flat now. And I'm about to try out and install a brand new feature of the new and improved auto floor guard, the stay put corners. Um, these guys are gonna help keep the mat from shifting as I drive onto it. And are really one of the best new features of this um, new and improved auto floor guard. And I'm excited to see how they, how they last. So what I have here is the brand new stay put corners. Um, these are easily packaged and ready to install. The directions are simple. This one goes on the garage floor. This one goes on the underside of the mat. Uh, they recommend cleaning with the um, included alcohol swab first just to ensure adhesion. Um, I think that's really great that they included that. And what we have here is basically what goes on the underside of the mat is the one side of the Velcro. On the, on the floor goes the other side. And this is going to enable our mat to be securely um, fastened to our floor um, but also allow for easy removal to rinse off outside or whatever so I think these stay put corners are going to be a huge improvement and I can't wait to try them out so I'm going to be installing the stay put corner right here on this back corner first so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure that I have marked out carefully where I want that corner to go I'm going to use the alcohol wipe to clean off the back of the mat and I'll attach the two parts and we'll be good to go I'm going to repeat that process on each of the corners and it should be pretty simple. All right, I'm onto the last corner and this baby is gonna be securely fastened to my garage floor. I could not be more excited about it. So again, I removed the backing. So I pop that backing right off. I pull back my auto floor guard and I securely attach it right in the corner where I need it to be. So I've attached it right in the corner. I'm gonna push down on that, make sure that it gets nice and adhered. And then I'm going to move on to the part for the floor. And I should be all set. So again, removing that backing. Um, I am going to simply match it up right on here. This is what's working best for me. Um, some people might advise that you put it directly on the floor. I prefer this method. So I'm sticking it right down. That corner is now securely fastened. This is gonna prevent any buckling or bubbling and it's gonna help my mat stay exactly where I need it to be. All right guys, the last thing I'd like to demonstrate for you, uh, you can see the auto floor guard has really collected a lot of slop and mess and water um, from the recent snow. Uh, the last thing I'd like to demonstrate, to you that demonstrate for you that comes with the um, new and improved auto floor guard is this free squeegee head, which is going to make uh, cleaning up this mess and getting it kind of off my mat when I'm ready um, a really a breeze. So they give you a squeegee head, what you're going to need to do is that you're going to need to find some uh, other random handle that you can use. I'm going to demonstrate with this broom that I have here. Um, so what I've done is I've actually loosened up this uh, handle head with a, just a Phillips screwdriver and now I'm going to easily be able to place it um, right on the end of my handle um, which is going to be nice. I'll just pop that down on there um, and if I want, if I'm feeling the need, I can tighten it up with just a simple Phillips head here. Um, I will just Tighten that up a little bit, uh, make sure it's gripped onto my handle, and now I'm gonna be ready to push this water around and clean everything up. So let's see how it goes. So I'm just gonna try and you know, mop this up, push this slop off my mat. Um, I can easily do this when I fall, clean up, all ready to go. I can push this all in one spot, push it out of my garage. This works great. I can kind of push it right out my garage door that mess out of my garage and outside. This squeegee head is pretty amazing.